I do it because I want to give back because I was a camper back in the day and I want to give my camper exactly what my counselor gave me which was the best experience of my life. I uh, became a friend, not just a counselor. It's a completely different relationship than a lot of these kids uh, tend to have. And they get to horseback ride and they don't get to horseback ride anywhere else. They come here and zip line and they don't get to zip line anywhere else. A girl in my cabin, I was there the first time ever in her life that she got to ride a horse. And that is a special memory that I will always cherish. One really good life lesson that I learned was that uh, I could always have it worse or there's always somebody that's got you know life worse than I do because I'm not, I'm, not, I'm not saying that I'm better than anyone here but I'm saying there's there's I've seen campers here that you know they have their their uh, or symptoms or disabilities or you know they're pretty they're pretty bad and it makes me think of how good I have it sometimes you know because of the stuff that I still can do that some others may not be able to do. As a firefighter for 35 years you know, MDA is our international charity of choice. Once you get involved in this, you come out here and you see what the kids do, you know, it is something that just, it makes you feel good in seeing how these kids can really, you know, get their week at camp. One of my little girls, she's 10, she looked at me and said, why does MDA camp have an age limit? If I could come to camp, If I could come to camp every year, I would. And a lot of times, <laughs> camp means more to the kids than we will ever know. And they don't always voice that. <laughs> it is a place for them to be normal. They don't get bullied. My girls can wear her, their back braces and not feel like they're being stared at. And it means a lot to them. 